Okay, okay, let's go and start this video. What is up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. And I hope you guys are having a fantastic day, as always. In today's video, as you guys see it by the title, we got two of our vehicle, vehicles missing. As you guys can see on the driveway, we only have the XLT, the Toyota, and the Ranger. So as you guys all know, we had an issue with, you know, next door neighbor. We had to put the truck over here because he, had, he was complaining about having my truck, well, that truck, in front of their house. But really, it wasn't blocking like their, their, their mailbox or, you know, just, just, you know, people that they don't like it. Look at all that, that old car. Cool, isn't it? That's cool. I wish one day I could buy one, but I don't think I will never buy it. But anyways, I will see you guys inside the car. Inside the Toyota, I'm gonna, you know, film this vlog inside the Toyota. I don't feel like just standing here and doing it, but see you in the Toyota. Me in the car, just start the car up. Boom, starts right up. And yes, the car is looking clean. We, I put seat cover on um, yesterday. I was cleaning that whole car up because, as you guys all know, my dad used this car for work. And um, every time that he was coming back from work, yes, the car was just a mess. So I decided to put this um, cover seat on and it will protect the car a lot more. But now let me turn on the AC because I'm, wow, toasting myself like crazy. But anyway, um, as you guys all know in last, the last video, as you guys see, the platinum, we had to take it for service. Um, as you guys all know, we need oil change, we need new brakes, and then other few stuff that I got a phone call from the dealership. The truck is currently ready. Ready. Um, they're looking over the truck again, um, seeing if some, there's something wrong with the truck. That you know, they're gonna give me a call and you know see if we want to replace it. Um, obviously, I told the dealership that i want to replace everything that's wrong with the truck um i did have a phone call like i said they call me that he, he has another few things and um i told the guy to replace everything that was wrong with the truck and um the cost statement that the guy gave me is over 700 dollars um i know i know 700 dollars is a lot um and yes, people will not believe this, but me and my dad were the ones who paid this. Um, I do get paid because I work with my dad construction. Some of you don't know that. Some of you don't, but now you know. Um, I do get paid with, because my I work construction with my dad. Um, but I help my dad pay that bill. We didn't pay it yet, um, but we still need to go pick up the truck. I think we're going to go pick it up. I think it's a maybe Tuesday or maybe Monday on us look out for that video I think that video will be in the channel maybe Tuesday I don't know but yeah guys I'm gonna make you know the truck look you know right smooth as you know as we can um as you guys all know I'm planning to get some new wheels new tires for the truck that will be coming soon but for now we put we rotated the tires. We did a few things on the truck because there were kind of a lot of things that were wrong with the truck. Um, like I said, it's $700 of what everything they fixed. I don't know, I don't know on top of my mind what actually they fixed, but when, to, when tomorrow I get the paperwork and it says everything that they replaced on the truck, Oh, you know, I'm gonna make the whole video about it. I'm gonna show you guys what was replaced on the truck, and um, yeah, you guys will see, you know, the truck being, you know, riding good. I'm gonna see the statement, <laughs> but yeah. I wanna talk now about the Acadia. As you guys all know, my 2014 GMC Acadia. We have been owning this vehicle for two years now. 
two years. It has been incredible. Um, like I said, uh, my dad has plans of getting rid of it. My mom does not want to get rid of it. She loves the Arcadia. I personally do love the Arcadia. I just do not feel like driving. Well, when I get to drive a vehicle, I don't feel like always driving an SUV or always driving a car. I always like feel like driving trucks. I think that's what I a truck person. I am a truck person, so don't complain. Don't go to my Instagram and leave your dirty comments saying that, oh, but your cars and trucks are the same thing. They are, but I think truck are safe. Cars are, you know, they just are so little. In an accident, you might get, you know, maybe like that, that impact is going to be worse than a truck. But yeah, I love cars because I do. I love my Toyota Camry. I do love this thing. Um, it's powerful. I love my Acadia. I do love the Acadia, but I just am a truck person. That's what it is. I'm a truck person. Um, yeah, nobody can change that. I mean, I do love sport cars like Ferraris, Lamborghinis. My favorite sport cars is the Lamborghini Aventador um, or the Ferrari F12. Or the Lamborghini Yaris. That's an SUV, but it's fast. It's a Lamborghini still. But anyways, um, the GMC Acadia is currently on the mechanic, as you guys all know. Um, we do need to replace some stuff on that. I was planning to take the truck, I mean, the Acadia, to GMC dealership. I did though. I didn't film this, but I did. The truck is not the vehicle. <laughs> You see, as you guys, I used to say truck. I'm a truck person. But anyways, we did took the GMC to the GMC dealership. Um, They look over the, the, the Acadia. They told us what was wrong. And um, when they did that, we had to pay $200 because, the, the, you know, they ch charge for, you know, looking the whole vehicle and, you know, t uh, telling us what is wrong. So they did tell us what was wrong. Not a lot of not a, not a lot of things were wrong. A few things were. Um, so we decided to just take the Acadia to my dad's friend. He's a mechanic. Um, he is the one who owns the Chevy Silverado that I have been clickbaiting for a while. But you know, I gotta you know, people will not believe me, but I will. I I'm promise. This is a promise from my heart. I will make a video of that Chevy Silverado because I always talk like that truck is so impressive and it is but you guys don't believe me because I just have not make a video about it now today is a beautiful day by the way so if this Friday today is Sunday if this Friday the, the, the weather is like this I might make a video I might about that truck but the reason I have not making that video of that Chevy Silverado is because the owner, you know, he works, he works on um, diesel mechanic. He always busy. So, you know, I cannot like, like, you know, I cannot go like, oh, can I make a video of the truck? And he is not, you know, available for me to do it. But anyways. Look at me, bro. Anyways. um, By the way. Probably you guys won't see that, but when I went like, why are you looking at me, bro? It's like my neighbor, just my neighbor, my good old neighbor, just arrived to his house. I don't really don't care about. Anyways, let's get back to the Acadia. The Acadia is currently on the mechanic. Like I said, we will pick it up around a month because the mechanic says that there's a lot of things that he found wrong, like the same thing that the dealership told us that we're wrong he's the same th the same thing that he told us we're wrong so you know i'm not saying blaming him that he was incorrect but he was correct so you know everything is good there's nothing bad with uh, you know there's nothing bad with you know transmission or motor problems with the acadia everything is good uh we will be picking up the acadia in around a month 
the platinum we will pick it up tomorrow then i think the xlt might we might be leaving the house for a little while for you know some because my uncle just arrived today sunday march 7 i think i will tell you now if it's 7 march 8 my uncle just arrived from puerto rico to new york as you guys all know my uncle lives on new york and um my uncle got surgery of his eyes because he was working construction and something just fall on his eyes and he almost lose he lost his eye he couldn't see anymore but thank god everything is okay but my uncle moved from Puerto Rico to New York so now on my vlogs some of my vlogs lives on New York I live from Pennsylvania one hour two hours almost away um, you will not see him in like every vlog but you will see him on some vlogs because he's coming he's supposed to come this Saturday or Friday or Sunday I don't even know but he was supposed to come and I'm so happy like he came in December um, but yeah, I, I'm just sharing part of my life with you guys. You guys are, you know, part of my life as well as you guys all know. Half of my life is out there on YouTube, you know. But yeah, guys, this is gonna make it for today's video. The Acadia is not coming back for in a month. The Platinum is ready, we just no, need to go pick it up. But yeah guys, I hope you guys found this video interesting. Please give it a big thumbs up if you haven't already and you want to. Please subscribe. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.